Western and throughout the season I'm going to be chatting to a different teammate each week. Today we're at our second home, the Victorian Institute of Sport, the VIS, and I'm going to go and try and find Miss Emily Maddox. I know for me it was always kind of about like the female friendship and the team sport element, but like I know you were a star cross country runner. Ah, so fast. Um, nearly met B Morgan Mitchell, as I've told this story. <laughs> it's it's a like to many times, but I'm going to tell it one more time. Nearly beat Morgan Mitchell in a cross country race. She picked me in the post by one second. I was streamed down the hill, and the, my motivation was. My granddad, who um, is no longer with us, he always had a thing that we couldn't get our ears pierced till we were 16. And I was about nine at the time running this cross country race, and mum said, Oh, we won't tell granddad, but if you make nationals, you can get ears pierced. So I'm running down the hill trying to beat Morgan, and I lost by one second. Um, but no, I think getting into netball, it was all about the team aspect, and mum coached me in my first team called the Blue Bells. Um, we wore the little, the little, oh, the wrap around, the wrap around, the clips. Yeah. Kids these days, I mean, they don't have that. Straight away. That used to be the biggest upgrade oh. in the netball world when you went from a polo and a skirt to, to a, a body dress. suit. Do and a body suit, suit. Well, yeah. yeah. I mean, that's another winning issue. I didn't grow tall until I was about 15, so I was sort of average height. So I played goal attack mm -hmm. um, to start off with, and then as I grew a little bit, yeah, year eight, year nine, I went to goal shooter. So Di uh, used to coach me at Grammar, Geelong mm -hmm. Grammar, and at Bell Park, um, and I played goal shooter there. So I sort of, I had already transitioned to defence, you know, when I was about 15, but yeah, when I was about 18, I was still playing goals as well. I remember that because we've known each other since we were 15. Yes. And you were a defender then when we were I was, together. Yeah. But mm -hmm. you were just moonlighting as a goal shooter. How dare you betray me well, like that? You need to be versatile, <laughs> Joe. And now I know how to, like, in my head when I'm playing mm -hmm. goal I'm like, oh, I so know what you're going to do. Oh, I'm trying to set you up with <laughs> Oh, I'm trying to scream me. I know how to do that. If you had to pick a song to sing by yourself, what do you think it would be? I do know all the words to Downtown by Macklemore, as you've heard you many times. I love that. Yeah, I mean, yeah. No, I do love that song. It's because when I did a stint at the uh, AIS, when it was the Centre of Excellence, mm. um, obviously you have a lot of time in those uh, dorms you slash did, rooms. Yes. So that's when the song came out, and I just learned it, like word for word. Word for word. I play a verse over verse, just to learn it. Um, so I'm very proud of that achievement. Okay, um, we were discussing this yeah. before. So say so we're having a conversation and I'm like quite fatigued and I need to yawn. Like, oh yeah. Okay, I need you to give me your best, like, I'm yawning but I don't want you to know that I'm yawning. <laughs> so, well, I do this all the time but when I'm talking to Ari, he knows, he says, are you, are you yawning? <laughs> you can't you know. Know. But it's like the mouth closed while doing it. You're like, no, I'm going to try, no, I'm gonna try <laughs> and yawn. Do you know what you say the word yawn and you try to yeah. yawn? <laughs> you just keep it closed because you don't want to open it. <laughs> Looks like that. Thanks for coming along with me to find out a little bit more. 
more about Emily Maddox. Make sure you tune in next week to find out a little bit more about another teammate of mine. Hi, welcome back to Weston's Word of the Week. The word of this week is Miriam. Uh, if I was good at using it in a sentence, it would be myriad oh, of sports. I played a myriad of sports. I think it's been a lot. Like many, like a lot. many things. I'm going to Google that because Might I need something else. Then. Oh no, I need the definition on okay. speed down. Um, a lot. Let's go with a lot. Okay. Passion. <laughs>